As previously mentioned, students seeking university honors are required to complete three honors experiences from at least two of the five different CLIPS domains, while students seeking highest honors are required to complete five honors experiences from at least three of the five different CLIPS domains. The categories for co-curricular experiences are buried and broad to allow students seeking university and or highest honors to select a set of enriching experiences that they find personally meaningful and worthwhile. These five CLIPS domains provide a wide range of co-curricular choices and give students maximum flexibility in designing their own pathway to an honors degree. To qualify as a CLIPS co-curricular activity, participation in an activity cannot meet the general education requirements or requirements for a major or minor. For example, if a student is required to participate in a music ensemble or to complete an internship, that activity cannot be counted as being one of the CLIPS requirements. The only exceptions to this rule involve participation in study abroad or EMU US travel courses, both of which can be used to meet the cultural exploration requirement for all students. The acronym CLIPS refers to the five different categories of co-curricular activities. First, we have cultural exploration for C, which is centered around deepening the cultural understandings of honor students by promoting global citizenship, multicultural understanding, and awareness of one's cultural orientations. Here's a list of examples of acceptable cultural exploration activities. Next is leadership and civic engagement for L, which aims at developing the leadership skills or enhancing community engagement of honor students by leading others to accomplish a goal or demonstrating active involvement in civic and community life. Now is intellectual academic activity for I, which is about enriching the intellectual lives of honor students by promoting growth as academic scholar, researcher, and creative thinker, or involves the production of new knowledge or creative work. Professional development for P, which enhances the professional development of honor students by involving activities that lead to professional growth, the development of professional skill sets, or immersion in a professional context. And lastly, skill development for S which is rooted in assisting honor students in learning new skills by involving the acquisition of a skill set or lifestyle pattern independent of professional development or cultural exploration. Students may also propose that an experience or activity not listed on any of the previous slides be allowed to meet one of the CLIPS requirements. To do so, they must complete the honors pre-approval form available on the forums page of the EMU Honors College website.